So with today's winner of the round four of the Benchmark Series, the Hokitika Classic, um, Sam, was that race that you, uh, you obviously were wearing a skin suit today, so maybe looking for a sneaky breakaway at some stage, but in the end it came down to a sprint with four of you. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Um, I did think uh, I might get a chance of uh, jumping away by myself, especially with that uh, long run along the coast, but uh, the way it unfolded and the long game of breakaway, uh, yeah, a small bunch of rings, how, how it happened, and I was happy to take the win. So a couple of early breaks uh, that got away early on, you weren't too concerned about that, you sort of waited patiently and then when the, the moment came, you uh, smacked it quite hard up the blue spur there, bridged across and then uh, there was a pretty select group at the end. Um, yeah, well actually that, that big group, the big breakaway formed uh, very early on, up the first climb, um, and I sensed it was dangerous because they had sort of one guy from one or two guys from all the major teams, so I skipped across to that, um, and that group worked really well together. I think there were 10 or 12 of us, and um, we took minutes and minutes out of the main field. Um, and that, we continued to work well together until, yeah, the second time around that Blue Spur circuit and all split up. It's turned into a real race of attrition, really. Now, you've had some recent racing in Australia for your UCI Continental team over there, the budget forklifts. Obviously, you carry a bit of form into today. That's right, yeah, I'm straight off uh, the Tour of Gippsland, where our team had some uh, real success. Um, I'm actually off to Tour of Great South Coast uh, on Monday. Um, so it's, it's still early days, but um, yeah, I'm, I'm feeling pretty good.